Okay, what's up guys? Um, I actually just started recording because uh, something really strange just happened and it's probably nothing, but I record everything just because uh, I want to get as much footage, footage as possible for some of these videos because strange stuff happens all the time and I just want to get it all on record. So I'm recording this because my parents told me to go check the mail. Uh, I came out here, I opened the mailbox up and on top of the mail is this strange looking uh, envelope with like a, a Russian Russian name with a return address that's I, I looked up the house when I went inside I looked up the, the address and it's like there's it doesn't look like there's anything there so it's a return address that like doesn't exist or something and it's this weird like acrylic Russian so this is what happened this is what I saw when I opened my mailbox it's addressed to me and uh, I don't know what this means someone if someone knows Russian or this definitely looks like Russian. If anyone knows Russian, please translate for me. A O K T O P B O P four E B. I don't know what that that A is. What tipped me off though is that it looks Russian, because that looks like a Russian acrylic uh, acrylic letter. So yeah, this is what I got in my mail. There's definitely something in here, something thick. You know, I'm gonna call Dan. Yo, yo. What's it good? Hey, dude. Um, this is probably nothing, but uh, I found this uh, this really weird um, this really weird envelope that came in my mail. It's a very small envelope, um, and the return address is it's written in like some sort of acrylic language. It's like some Eastern European. It looks it looks like Russian Russian acrylic language or something. Um, and get this, the, re the re yeah, the, re the return address is um, an address that doesn't, it, it like doesn't exist. It's just like this, this field, and it, it just looks like, it, it looks like either an abandoned building or like a, it looks really rough. It looks like there's no one living there, dude. I don't know what the hell to make of this, but that, and that address basically doesn't exist. And you said it was in your mailbox? Yeah. There's a stamp and everything. It went through the mail. Okay, uh, well, I mean, I'm already, uh, I'm already on my way out. I'm only, like, 20 minutes away, so, uh, we'll check, we'll check it out when I get there. Okay. Alright, yeah, sounds good. Alright, see you in a bit. Alright, peace. So, Dan's gonna be here, Dan's gonna be here in a bit, and we are going to open this up, uh, when he gets here. Very, very strange. Alright, I just pulled up at Max's, um... I don't know what he's talking about. Like he said, he got some sort of like cryptic note or something. I don't know. I don't know. Nothing really surprises me anymore. So let's uh, let's go find out what our what our adventure is for the evening. Yo yo. What's good? What's good, bro? Not much. What the hell is this? <laughs> huh? What? Did you open it yet? No. Let's open it. All right. A knife? So all I can only think of one thing an intent would be. Red yeah, definitely. It has to be. It's the only thing that makes sense. Should this make sense? Come on. Come on. Like... Why else would we just get... People who do Randonautica... Just get a random intent in the mailbox. Like, do you think this is just another coincidence? Probably not. Yeah, exactly. But I mean, what the hell is up with the fake address in the Russian name? What's what's the return address? Two Hickory Lane, Oak Brook. Hickory Lane's a real thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The, I mean, but the ad, did you see the map? Yeah. Did you see what's there? Doesn't look like much. There's a couple houses. I don't know. I, I think we should go check that out. That that oh, looks absolutely. sketch. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah, let's go do it right now. 
Oh, there's still light out. We don't All know right. what's waiting out there for us. Yeah, for real. So we are on our way to Hickory Lane right now. It's about a 25 minute drive. We're about halfway there. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, about 12 minutes left. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm interested to see uh, what is going to be at this Hickory Lane. It just, just doesn't make sense. Either A, this is from one of our viewers. Oh, that could be true. It could be like a prank or something from one of our viewers. Or just somebody who wants to give us an intent. Yeah, true. So, which sorry if, if it is, we're, we're coming to your house right now. Well, I mean, they kind of just left their address there, so I can't be... They, yeah. they wouldn't be too, like, mad if it was a viewer, right? No, I wouldn't think so. I mean, they left their... Like you just said, they left their address on it, so... I don't think... It's I like, what do you want us to do if you're going to leave your address on I it? I don't think anyone lives here. Unless whoever said it is, like, a homeless bum. Why? I mean, there's just nothing there. There are a couple houses there, isn't there? But not this specific address, no. Oh, I didn't even... I just looked up Hickory Lane. I didn't even look up. I mean, there's a crusty pool. Look at that pool. Okay, yeah, you, that doesn't even look like a pool. It's like a cement foundation. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure. I don't think we did. No, that's two Hickory Lane. That's the that's the mess up one. I have no idea. We can get ambushed by the stalker here, so. Yeah, yeah, that's why I wanted to go before it was dark, so we at least had, like, some sort of advantage. Yeah. You're right, it could be the stalker, it could be those guys that have been setting us up with all those other weird clues. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I don't know what this is at all. We've had a lot of weird stuff going on with this. Lately. Yeah, straight up. Especially this past week and a half or so. We had nothing for a while, it was like nothing. We were, we were, we were in the clear. Nothing strange was happening for about a month, month and a half, and then all of a sudden, oh, yeah, just this kind of loose. stuff yeah, yeah. just started happening. Stranger than ever before, too. We used to find, like, a murder, we found, like, murder weapons. We found, like, a gas leak or something. We don't even know what it was. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Yeah, it was just, like, something smoking out of the ground. It wasn't a volcano. So it was probably gas or something. Um, and now we're finding, finding like, severed hands. And yeah. What else did we find? We found the severed hand. We found that, we found that camera that was in the that yeah, yeah, handful the camera of the, blood. The puzzle piece. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, yeah, the puzzle piece. Hickory Lane. Dude, this looks really sketch. Yeah, this looks like really run down. Is there anything even back here? I don't know. Wow. Holy crap. Dude, everything's abandoned. Yeah. So I think I think two Hickory Lane was back here. What the hell? No one, dude, no one lives here. Yeah, look, it doesn't even have a front door. I think two's over by this, uh, behind, right over here. Yeah, that's, that's where the marker oh. is. What ha dude, what happened to this block? This is it? This is it? Oh yeah, yeah, that's where that's where it ended at. Well, obviously nobody lives here, so they were just they just had to use it as a burner address, I bet. Tent bedroom. So what, why did they give us a return address? Oh, I guess maybe. Yeah, a burner address. You know, they just didn't want us to find it. Or find out who they were. Hold on a second. What? Dude, what if they want us to set the intention here? Here? Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, doesn't it? All right, let's do it. We have to send an intention anyway, yeah. Yeah, get that, get that random nautic up. Here we go. Yeah, so I guess, uh, I guess... We're just gonna set it here. I think that's what they want us to do. Should be interesting. Find her. 
Ready? All right, here we go. All right. Red rum. 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 Man. Red rum. Red rum. Come on, give us something. You got something? Yeah. Where is it? Oh, that's kind of far. Yeah. Dude, that's dude, that's a distance. How long do you set the radius? It's normal, like normal. That's definitely not, dude. That's way outside of our, our radius. Are you sure? It's, yeah. It might just be on the edge. Yeah. No, that does seem a little bit far. Where's it by though? Uh, it looks like a river or something. Again? Yeah. All right, let's do it. So yeah, we got our intention set. We'll see if uh, we'll see what it takes us to. Yeah. I don't know. What, how do you feel about this? I don't. I don't know. Uh, dude, I, I have no idea. This is, this is yeah. This is the most. This is like one of the most bizarre things that's happened to us yet. We could be walking into some serious right now. Well, I say let's yeah. Let's get going while it's still light out. Then. All right. Yeah. Tension is back here, so we got to go on this road or whatever the hell this is for a bit. It's like on a peninsula or something, dude. Really? Yeah. That's kind of cool. Like we said, we got here in really good time because we, we don't know what we're walking into at all. Yeah. So we wanted to get here before the sun went down. So so no one could be like creeping in the shadows. Yeah. Which I mean, it could still us. happen, but let's hope. Yeah, but it's easier to yeah, it's going to be much easier to spot people in the daytime though. Plus, there's more people out. Yeah. This used to be like a frontage road or something? The highway is like right there. Yeah, I don't know. It must be like an access. Alright guys, so we're not too terribly far away. Um seemed like a pretty short or yeah, pretty quick walk. So I don't know. I'm interested to see this because like, dude, what do you think about that house there? Which one? Oh, the, the abandoned one? We one? Just went to, yeah. I have no idea. I think maybe yeah, it might have been a burner address or something. It had to have been. It had to have been 100%. Yeah, or there. someone's living in there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but if they were, I mean, I wouldn't want to find out. Yeah, same. There's a okay, so there's like a lake up here. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're looks like we're coming right up on a lake. Um, sorry, if, sorry if there's a lot of wind noise, guys. It's uh, yeah, I, I wasn't planning for this. Yeah, it looks like it clears to a little park here. So it's on. It's on wherever this is. It looks like there's part of the lake on this side and part of the lake on that side. All right, so looks like according to Max, we're getting really close. I wonder who left their bikes here. Yeah, someone just totally left their bike here. Huh, that's weird. I have no idea. It's rusty. Looks like it's been here maybe all winter. Yeah. Maybe somebody stole it, ditched it back here real quick. Yeah, and then just forgot about it or yeah. didn't want to come back. It's like it's it's right right near this tree. Um, I think the bike might have been our intention because we passed it. Oh, there's a marker right on it. Yeah. Right. Yeah, right here. The bike is the bike is the thing. Really? Yeah, the bike is the point. Really? 
red rum? Like, what's that have to do with? Because you know what red rum is. Yeah, right. yeah. It's from that movie. Shining. Yeah, yeah. So if you guys don't know, and you haven't seen the movie The Shining, um, they, there's this thing called red rum, and it's it's murder spelled backwards. Mm -hmm. So when we got the intent, we're kind of like, you know. That's pretty. Yeah, it's it's like typical. Yeah, yeah, very cliche, cliche. Yeah, yeah. cliche. Um, so that that's why we're kind of like, huh? And now seeing a bike bring mm -hmm. us to a bike, like it doesn't make red rum makes no sense. Yeah, the bike's red, maybe. I don't know. I ran out of space. Oh, okay. I don't know. It's like let's see if there's anything on it. Anything out of place on it? Maybe someone stuffed something in the frame. If we can get the frame off. Yeah. It's a lot of effort. Yeah, oh yeah, we can just go through the seat. Hmm. Yeah, see if there's anything down there. Like in there. Water leaks. Yeah, so there's probably not. Uh, yeah, there's probably not anything like. <laughs> yeah, there's, uh, so I'm guessing there's like nothing stuffed in there. Water's coming out. It's like so pull it out of the freaking lake. Wait. Hey, something's out of place at that seat. Look at the seat. Was that like a what? tag? No, uh, oh. underneath the tag. That's that's definitely new. Yeah. yeah. You can get it out. Yeah, it what does look it? new. There's a little bit of mud on it, but... Here is your reward. The two things needed for growth. Here is your reward. So there's something... The bike? You want a bike? It said, here's your reward. Here is your reward. The two things what? Needed, needed for, growth? for growth? What is it? But some sort of riddle? Well, why is it on the bike? You know what I mean? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Bike? So, like, here's the reward, the bike. You see. When you're a kid, you ride a bike. Oh. Yeah, like, you grow up. You know, everybody has a bike. You learn how to ride it. You don't need to fall. But you don't need to fall for growth. That doesn't make any sense. Two things needed for growth. Get the sun's sun starting to go down too. Wait a second. What? Two things needed for growth. Light. Right? If a plant's gonna grow, light and water, right? I mean, I'm going off of like plants, you know? Unless you're talking about like human growth. I mean, I kind of, I guess that's, that's yeah. Well, that's kind of the base of anything though, water and light. You need sunlight to survive and water. Wait. So that's our reward? They brought us to the park, we got water and light? I don't know. The bike came from the water, maybe. Looks like it was it looks like it was pulled out of the water. Yeah, it really does. Actually I'm certain that it was pulled out of the water. Yeah. Well after it was pulled out, then that was put on there, because that's new. Yeah, that didn't go down with the bike. Well, I mean this is definitely if somebody's pulling a prank on us, this is definitely a very complex prank. It's also a very lame prank. I don't see the humor in it. <laughs> Yeah, neither do I. It's not funny. All right, well, what do you want to do? I don't know, maybe take some pictures of the bike. Yeah. I, don't, I mean, we can't put that in your car, and I'm, I'm sure you don't no, want to. No, no, yes, we're definitely not putting that in the car. We can come back and throw it and see if we can get my dad's Range Rover to throw it in the back of there. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, we, we, it'd be much better to dirty up the Range Rover instead of a Honda. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> There's room for it though. <laughs> yeah, it's true. But yeah, we couldn't even get the, get it in there if we wanted to. All right, yeah, let's head back. 
I, I don't want, see, that's what I'm kind of worried about now, is it is getting dark. So does this, like, whoever whoever's out here, did they want us to be fiddling around until it got dark out, then they're going to ambush us? You know what I mean? Yeah. So I say we just get out of here now. Because they, they might have known how we, they might have known how we are, and that they're just going to, like, stall here until, uh, that we're just going to stall here and try and figure this out, and they're going to pop up from somewhere. Yeah, let's go and somewhere we're in the else middle and of solve this. I mean, there's houses around, but I still don't, you know, yeah. I still don't want to be out here. Well, I don't know. Feel a little bit safer right here, though. Yeah. We, we just we just wanted to get out of that path that's all secluded and stuff before it got too dark. Um. Now we're just kind of pondering, like, what does this mean? Does it mean anything, or is this just like you know a really elaborate prank or something? Which I mean, obviously, you know, if the stalker figured out how to manipulate the app there's no reason like one of our viewers couldn't figure out how to manipulate the app yeah, that's true. and like just give us something like this oh watch out so yeah i don't know um something written on the back of this i didn't notice that before what's that written on the back. You're right. You're right, there is. What is it? Wait, is that like secret ink or something? I don't know, because that's, th that's like cardstock. It's paper, so it's thick. Ooh. Whoa. Can you read it? Dude, you can't. That's an onion address. Hold on. Red. Red room. room. Red room. And then there's some onion address on here. Yeah, dude. So there's, it's there's all a, legible. It's a red room address? Dude, I guess so. But that's it. I don't see anything else right now. Yo! Water and light. Yeah! Water and Water light. Water and light. <sighs> a reward is a red one? I definitely wouldn't say that's a reward. Whoever it is obviously wants us to find it, though. So... What time is it? 6.42. Yeah. Uh, uh, we got time to get back to your place and fire up the computer. Yeah. Or out to the RV, wherever we want to go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here. Yeah, we need to see what's on this right now. We should call, you should call up Lorenzo, too, and, have him, and give him the address. I lost the uh, piece of paper. The reward one. But there wasn't anything written on there. That's all right. Hopefully, it's all right. That that was a th that was uh, that was a thin piece of paper. Yeah, I don't think there was anything on there. No. All right. Uh, I'm not too worried about. It. Let's just get out of here. We need to get to a computer immediately. All right. That's for sure. So now we're leaving um, the spot where we just found that bike and that message that was stuffed in it. Um, I can't make any sense of this still. No, no, not at all. Uh, but we are going to see what this, uh, this dark website is all about. Obviously it says a red room, so it's probably a red room. Yeah. Anyone who doesn't know, um, a red room is like a place where people pay to watch people get tortured. So there'll be like a victim, like tied to a chair or something, and then people mm -hmm. will send, uh, different types of cryptocurrency in and, uh, Ask, ask them to yeah. do, do stuff. Yeah, uh -huh. we 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 ran across one before. At least so like wait. two or three, right? Yeah, dude, it's been bad because yeah. 
Uh, so I'm not looking forward to seeing another one of these things, but I mean, if there's anything we can do, they obviously want us to see it for a reason. Uh -huh. You know, they went, whoever did this, which is probably either A, the stalker, or B, the heavy hitters guys, or C, I don't know who else is out there. They went through a lot of trouble to make sure that we see this. Yeah. So. There's Avatrix. Our old yeah, friends from Zavitrix. Zavitrix, yeah. I haven't heard from them lately. Maybe they're making a comeback. So, who knows. But, uh, yeah, we'll see, I guess. What if the... Okay, what if the bike came from someone who was kidnapped? They're in the red room. Dude, I didn't think about that. But that bike's rusty. Well, I guess they, they you know, they could have... They could have been chained up for a long time. I guess that, yeah, it doesn't have to be some of the reasons. I don't know. We're gonna find out pretty quickly. Okay, so uh, we almost made it back to my house. Um, we're about 10 minutes away, just making a quick stop. Um, we don't know what we're about to. Uh, about to see on this website, probably obviously Red Room, but mm -hmm. uh, yeah, we're gonna go there, plug it in on the computer, and uh, next video we're gonna show you guys, uh, you know, what the hell happened. Yeah, once we figure it out. So we're, we're pretty much gonna keep filming right after this. But uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Check out our Instagram, curse.urban. Uh, check out our Patreon. All the links to our socials will be in the description below. And uh, we hope to see you on part two, which will be dropping a couple days after this once we figure out what's going on. Yeah. Okay. Peace out, guys. See you in the next one. Our theory is that someone has been manipulating the Randonautica algorithm and has been leading us on a trail of uh, red crumbs. Red. Red room. Yes. We're just looking around for anything sketchy. We're probably not going to catch anything. But, you know, we want to be around this area. There's a possibility that, uh... Is that fan look familiar to you? Dude, that's the right thing. What's going on, guys? So today we are back with a dark web red room that Randonautica led us to. If you've not seen that episode of Randonautica, uh, it will be linked down in the description. Long story short, we did a Randonautica and it took us to a dark web red room address, which we plugged in the computer and uh, yeah, that's definitely what we got. Yeah, so basically someone, we our theory is that someone has been manipulating the Randonautica algorithm and has been leading us on a trail of uh, breadcrumbs that they've left and leading us to weird stuff like vials of blood people's hands and finally it led us to this strange dot onion address which we think is a red room because it says red room on the piece of paper that we found through this randonautica experience so yeah we're gonna check this out today and hopefully it's a bluff hopefully it's not a red room because red rooms if you guys know are places on the dark web where people pay to watch people get tortured yeah it's, yeah, it's pretty bad currency there has been a countdown to this which we'll explain here in a second let's get on to it right now yeah. and see what we got going on Do it. All right, guys, so this is the following night after we found the paper. We went back to Max's house, plugged in the address, and there was a countdown timer that expires in approximately one minute from right now. Mm -hmm. Last night it was 24 hours, and now I think it's about ready to go up. Yeah. So let's plug in that site address and uh, this is, get... Yeah, this is the paper. Okay. Yep, right on time. Right on time. Ten seconds to go. So from what we've seen so far, it definitely looks like another red room. Like yeah. just like it said, for sure. Yeah. And we're not bluffing about this. No, there's a chat. Chat's chat's active right now. Alright. Yeah. 
right. Video's up. It's actually red. Yeah. Yeah, they're taking it uh, off. They're, they're actually doing something with the name of Red Room. Dude, is that like a mascot head? It looks like it. I was expecting the heavy hitters, guys, honestly. So much light above 0.8 Bitcoin. <sighs> Donation. With what, like... Light I guess we're going to find out because he's going to do it. That's nice. nice gun. Oh, it's it's a blowtorch. Dude, I don't want it. Dude, I don't want it. guy's smoking, dude. Yeah. Unreal. I'm just, dude, I'm just glad there's no audio with this. I don't want to watch this, but I, I can at least be thankful there's no audio. Alright, let's see what's he going to do next. Who are these people? I, dude, I don't know. I don't know. Donation. There we go. It's two time home Home improvement. What the hell does that mean? I don't know. Is that code for something? It beats me. He, uh, obviously, the uh, the mascot knows. Oh shit, he's pulling a drill. That's what he meant. Dude, this is... That's not good. No, it's not. Holy sh... Let's see if it's over. And... Yeah, he's dead. There he goes. At least he's... I mean, at least it's over. Yeah. Some of these victims of Red Rooms don't get don't get it this easy. A lot of things we've seen are worse than this. So this guy got off easy. Yeah. If you can believe that. Yeah, this is uh it's who's why why are people sending us this stuff? It's like it's straight up just to like taunt us now. Like that's what it's gotta be. Like it doesn't make any sense. They've seen our videos, maybe they're trying to Nobody who, who's on the dark web has just handed us their freaking um, dot onion address to a red room. And they didn't just hand it to us, obviously, but they, they led us on a, you know, little scavenger hunt puzzle type thing and we found it, so... Yeah, it's like all that you could do aside from literally just handing us the known person. Yeah, but no one's, like, wanted us to find their stuff until now. Yeah. This time, they someone wanted us to see this, and that's the difference between... Everything else we've ever done, all the red rooms we've seen, and this one. Is someone's deliberately showing us this. Yeah, that's that's actually a really good point. Dude, look. We're going hunting. We're going hunting. Next victim. Yeah, it's gotta be. So what do we do? Maybe they'll is give it, us another clue. Yeah, maybe. All right, guys, so big update, big update right now. We just had the computer sitting open, and uh, all of a sudden, the screen changed to a live stream. Um, it went from that happy hunting thing that you guys just saw to a live stream. So we think, and the chat's still going nuts, so what we think is happening is, uh, we gotta go. yeah, we, we think that... Um, we're gonna see the next victim get taken. Um, Cause this looks like a regular town like webcam. So we think they hacked into it and they're putting it up so they can see like, so the chat can see uh, who they take next. Cause obviously that's what the chat is implying right now. Lorenzo can't trace the IP. 
Well, that's not he surprising. Said, he said he might have someone who can trace the IP, but he can't reach him right now. Yeah, well, we don't have so. that. We don't have the time for that. Somebody's. I'm going to go off the assumption that somebody's going to get picked up here. Oh yeah. There's got to be. I mean, this is somewhere, and yeah. I guess it could be anywhere in the country, technically. Yeah, it could be. But I'm willing to bet it's closer to us since we got the note. And everything else that's been happening has been all in this area. Yeah. So. So. Uh, is there anything we. There, dude, there is something we recognize. What? Look. Back there. Corner. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, that the music store. That's where we set that intention last no time. No shit. Yeah. Uh, so guys, we're right now we're we're in the general area where we saw uh, that live stream on the computer. Yes. So, we're just looking around for anything sketchy. We're probably not going to catch anything. But, you know, we want to be around this area. It's not too big, so there's a possibility that, uh... Does that van look familiar to you? Dude, that's the red van. Dude, that's, that's the red van. That's it. What's it doing? I haven't seen that thing in like a year. Here, let's go over. That's it, right? Yeah, I'm no, not that's, crazy. that's 100% it. It's got those those stickers on the back. Yeah. That's it. That's the that's the van. Guys, if you don't know, if you if you guys are new fans and you haven't seen our old videos, we used to run into this red van that was uh, operated by this dark web organization. They were they had their fingers on a lot of pies, a lot of different stuff. Oh, here, here, here. all very terrible. Here. Over here, this way. This way. Let's hide behind these trees. behind these trees. Dude, Yo, somebody two, got out. Somebody two got guys out. just got out. Yo, that's that's definitely somebody, right? What the hell is going on? Dude, let's go get him. I bet he's... he's yeah, I guarantee that's one of the Red Room guys trying to find somebody else. Oh, on a busy this. night, on a busy night like tonight downtown, he's going to grab somebody if we don't do something. Okay. Um, Dude, let's just go up, play it chill. Like we're just walking across the street and we'll grab him. You don't think one of them should cut, up, cut, us off, cut him off? I don't care. We don't have the time to plan this out. Let's just go. All right. Play it, play it cool, though. Let's, let's just act like... Dude, he's running. Go. Hey! <sighs> Shit. Yeah. I got that all on video, dude. Same. Well, where's your car? Huh? We might as well try to get back in your car and and go after it. I mean, they're probably gonna hit the highway, but I mean, let's just give it a shot. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's go. Alright guys, so we circled around trying to find the van. Of course, you know, they're long gone. No, no clue. No clue where they went. It sucks because we know they're still out there somewhere. Probably watching us right now. There's little we can do. Yeah, we don't, uh, we don't exactly know where they are. Um, we tried even hitting the highway. We cannot see any sign of the red van. So I think this is, 
the end of this video as far as we know it. But if you like these videos, please like and subscribe. If you want to see them as soon as they come out, please hit that bell and uh, check out our, our Patreon and our Instagram, Urban. Yep, all our socials will be down below, along with a playlist to the rest of this saga if you want to get caught up. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Peace out, guys.